what is up guys Kitty Kev here and today in the a bit series we're going to be doing another Vegeta yes we a couple of while well, quite, a, quite a bit ago we did a Super Saiyan Vegeta and now we're going to be doing the normal version of him so that for this you're going to need the black wall you need the blue wall the yellow wall the white stained clay and some white wall so as always never build anything on the ground guys it's just a pro tip for you because um, throughout obviously all my other videos nothing is built on the floor because I don't really like the look of it when it's on the floor it just makes it look pretty shitty so it's pretty much exactly if you remember the last one it's pretty much almost identical to the last one a couple of color different changes a couple of hand changes uh, facial changes and a slightly different variation of hair but besides that it's pretty much the same so what we're gonna do is start off with this block here and you want seven blocks however sort of long or far however in a particular order that you want so I'm gonna put two three uh, four then I can put another one two and then one over here which is seven along in total now from the end one here we're gonna obviously start with the left hand side of his foot just gonna make it nice and easy and come up too high so three in total one two three come along an extra two up like so so miss one two up again and exactly the same on this side just put an extra one and then an extra one on this side but on this one we're going to come up two high two more high there we go like so three i'm just going to double that up on the right as well so it's obviously a three higher by two along what we're going to do here is probably the easiest bet it's probably going to have two white underneath this is, these are not tax tax is something well if i say it's attack it will be removed later on so for instance if i put a uh, attack up here this can be any color but for preference wise we can use white because it stands out attack I'll remove it straight after I place another block and I will say if it is or is an attack so don't worry so from these two white going up to the right I'm gonna go an extra five one two three four five like so underneath that come back in one two underneath one underneath the third one here come an extra two out one two one underneath there and just an extra one along there it's going to come mm, probably a little bit, a little bit of a food bar there. One, one up there, one up there. Yeah, one along, one along. There will be two minutes, guys. Two up along there. Ah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, it's two up that way. My bad. The two up this way. So instead of the forward block being downwards, it needs to go upwards. And it's a simple variation, just click on the bevel on. I'll have a little look there as well. Obviously, any food bars or muck ups, you can go back and have a look. But that, that is the best one there. So, let's fill in the rest of this foot here. Nice, easy work here. First one, this one here, which is on the third block along here. I'm going to come one underneath, so one white. Come two white along. Oh, two white along. Then a black. And then underneath that or just the rest of this actually you can just fill it in with white that's pretty nice and easy and fill it in with the white now i must recommend as well obviously if you've seen the thumbnail that's what we're going to be making but if you've just joined and just randomly click this link obviously that may not look like a foot now nor did the other one when we started it didn't look anything like what we were trying to build but at the end it looked pretty amazing i was pretty impressed with myself so yeah hold on to that so don't do anything yet so we're going to make this a three high three by three and we're going to do the exactly the same on this side as well just to bulk it out a little bit more gonna just come one underneath here just connect there and then one underneath again like so now as you can see here this block is just placed underneath like so it's just gonna put another attach another one on the side of it like so one there which is gonna carry on up the top up here Put an extra one on top of there like so and just put one up and next against it now what I'm going to do is actually just skip all the way onto the other side of the foot with the right foot which are his left foot which uh, would be a little bit easier so the easiest way to do this guys is literally come underneath as I say from the second block underneath his foot here all the way along and you just want to come all the way along just come all the way along it doesn't matter how many blocks this is because obviously that they are all tacks and they will be removed but just for the purpose of this, it's going to make it slightly easier for us to do. So from this black block, you can an extra one up. And you want to come an extra five along. So six in total. Two, three, four, five, six. And underneath that, and place another one. Make this a four block, like so. And then from there, you want to come an extra two down. One, two. 
from there, one long to the right, and then three underneath, so four in total, two, three, four. As you can see, it is slightly becoming a foot. One here, and obviously this is going to be the line for his foot, so now we can remove all of these white blocks along here. Let's remove all these white blocks, take it all out. Duh, 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 duh. Come on the way over to this black block here that we just placed. And it is six in total, so add them up five, two, three, four, five, six. So as you can see, six in total. One at the end there. I'm gonna put a white block here, which is needs to stay, which is not is not attack, so keep it. One on top of that, two white, and one on top of that as well. And from this one here, you just want to come an extra two high. One, two. And from there you can place a white. And then a black till it connects, like so. Beautiful. If we come in here as well, it's just going to be filling the rest of his foot. So as you can see, there's three, the sink three here. We come all the way into the middle one here. Come an extra two out, one, two, and the rest of that you can actually just fill in with a white wall. You can see, da, 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 beautiful, just fill in with a white wall. And on top of this as well, it's just another black block so all the way along till it connects. Now, a simpler way to do this is go from all the way to the end, so this block here in particular. Come into one, two with blue, leave two, come up an extra two high, so it's a six block, like so. And from there, for the six block, we want to come next along one, make this a four block, next along one again, make an L, so it gets a little bit tricky, switch back to here black. You just want to put a black stair set, like so, as you can see. Grab your blue again, and just put two blue underneath these stair set here, so something like that. Pretty snazzy, and then obviously on top of that black one as well, put another black. All we need to do now is pretty much just connect this with black, so just seal it all off. Pretty nice and easy, and all the way up. Beautiful. And these are going to be tacks, so they can actually. Yeah, these are going to be tacks, so you can actually remove these in a bit. But, uh, for the purpose of this, we're going to keep them. So we're going to put two white tacks. And either these two blocks, one block here and two blocks on this one. I should remove these now. And then from this white one here, put two white and a black, three along, all the way past on the left there. See this like little T column here? So you've got an extra one here, so one, down two, one, two, one along to the left. You can remove those white tacks now. I should keep those there, they're not going to be white tacks. Let's keep. Let's put those back, they're going to be his fingers actually. Screw it, I've decided, they're, they're going to be his fingers. Um, one white tack next to it. Uh, white, sorry, one white wall, it's not a tack, sorry, keep that there. And then, we're going to put one underneath here, one there, make an L again. Uh, two white walls next to it, one, two, move that one, one, two. One underneath and two on the right just to cover it up. One, two. One on top, make a little L again. There's quite a few L's in here. Two whites above that one, or next to that one, shall I say. And obviously underneath that it is going to be our blacks. And that's going to come just above and over that one. We have a one here, so it's going to be another two. One, two. And then from there, you can pretty much go all the way along. I'll probably say an extra six along. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And you can just come all the way along here. So it's going to be a three block. One, two, three. One, two, three. Obviously, it's going to be another three. One, two, three. Like so. You're going to miss this little bit here. So we're going to transfer back to a two block. So you can actually just put a white you know, a couple of white blocks here to so make a four block of white. Uh, actually, yeah, four block of white here. And you can pretty much just connect this all the way somewhat to the bottom of that. But we're not going to do that. We're going to do it like that. Much better. And two white on top of this either side. I'm going to move these tacks now. We don't need them. Hmm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna put another layer there, another two like that. So that's obviously his fingers there. Again, it looks, it doesn't look anything like fingers, but they are his fingers. Um, <laughs> pretty complicated, I know, but uh, that is his actual fingers. So from the two white here, 
which uh, as we all know which is going to be probably removed I'm going to say tack, tack wise yeah tack wise remove that so we're going to come down an extra one from this big beaker here come an extra three so four in total two three four like so and underneath that come back in one and come all the way down one two past the white and just connect it up with this one here now this line here is actually running all the way onto the other side of Vegeta's other side so it's just connecting the two sides together so on the specific line here just come all the way along doesn't really matter at this current point in time just come out along you think it is now we'll start from the base foot again because it's just a little bit easier so from the stem here as you've got the three as you can see we've got the four and tail but it's three one two three four like so is that correct mm, I'm not feeling that I'm not feeling that let's go whack this off like so take that off there we go this is the three now in total so the middle one here we'll go up another two Extra long one, extra long two. Oh wow, that is perfect. That's a perfect join. That is a perfect connect. Wow. Okay, so that is obviously Vegeta's pants. We just need to fill in the blue side here, which is really quite nice, easy, and simple. So we've got your blue. So there's a little gap here. I'm gonna come all the way up. Six, one, two, three, four, five, six. The sixth one, we put a black, and then a another blue. And then blues either side of the blacks. Black underneath, the blue on the right, and then continuously blue all the way down to the bottom. Like so. Switch to the other side. And you want to pretty much just fill the rest of this in. So three. That's obviously going to be four. It's obviously going to be three. That's two. And then uh, this should be an L. Which I'm right in thinking it is. So the rest of that you can actually just fill in with black. So there we go, Vegeta's pants are pretty much almost done. Now, let's switch back to your yellow blocks here. And this little gap here, as you can see, we can put two blocks here, one, two, and carry this on for another four. So one, two, so in total four, so two, four, like so. One piece out on the left hand side. Three up the top here to connect to the black and remove these white now as attacks. Don't worry about them. You want a black block either side of this yellow just to consume it, like so. This black line just to come all the way along. Like so, we should just connect. Now, the easiest way is to keep this white here because this now is his actual body. So, keep this white here. So, from the middle one in the middle here, come on, shot one up. One, two, three, sorry. One in the middle, like so. Actually, you can move skid skidges along a little bit. Yeah, I like it like that. Let's scooch it along a little bit and uh, take that down. So from here, you can actually just come all the way along and just conceal this white. Pretty nice and easy. Come up, mm, I'm going to say, an extra four, maybe. Yeah, one, two, three, four. So the fourth one, you can actually just put two gold blocks or two yellow blocks, pref personal preference. So I personally use yellow for this build. So after that, just leave that there, no need to worry about that, that's pretty awesome, pretty simple, pretty cool, cushy. From this black block here on the left hand side of the yellows that you just placed, you want to come up one, one to the left, one to the right, and from the right one you continue this, and you want to just conceal that yellow, and from that concealed yellow just from top of that one there, you want to come an extra three, so four in total, one, two, three, four, come along an extra one to the right, one. I'll put a white underneath, keep that there. Another white and another white, so three white. From this white coming out, you want to go an extra five. One, two, three, four, five, like so. One underneath, one on top. Have your white stain clay. Boop, and put one on the right. Three on the left. As you can see, one, two, three. Let me zoom out so you can have a quick look at that. Three on the left, one on the right, and then come back over to the right one. I'm going to put three yellow, one, two, three, on the top of that, again, three black, one, two, three, one on top of the far left, and another one on top of the far left. Come back over to your yellows, just connect it onto the right now, so one, two, underneath that, two yellows, one, two, underneath that as well, actually, yeah, underneath that, two blacks, one, two, one in the yellow, just to consume it, obviously, 
and then just here just put two black just underneath so you can see now if we fill this in this is going to be his shoulder blade or shoulder pads it's going to be one there and there's going to be one just over there so looking a little bit spaghetti junction at the moment i know i know trust me that's going to work so the, the whites here the three that colin you just placed here you can just fill this in now with just your white blocks like so and the same again with this black just come along here this is top bit and fill that in like so boom looking lovely the rest of these pants actually we can just fill in so just fill up all the rest of this area the covering area with uh, blacks just fill them all the way along here like so du, 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 du. fill that in there we go beautiful obviously leave those two there and the rest of that white you can just leave as well pretty damn easy so if you come all the way on this side here you can see the little white we got here let's build an L right next to this side here so one two one like that like a little L pretty cool pretty easy pretty kish so we're gonna do the rest of his obviously his neck bit here and we're gonna do the left hand side of his arm soon in a minute so after these two yellows here and place two black either side one on top again so an upside down L a white one, this is not a tax, so keep it down. Two next to the white on the right. One white underneath. And then a black, so it should connect. The rest of this area, really nice and simple. Just fill in the width of white. You can see, pretty darn easy. Fill that in with white, beautiful. Now, from these yellows, you want to come on extra. The same again, two, two along. And two along again, so it makes it a three. Make it a four block upstairs, like so. So if we took away these ones here, this will be a four block. I won't do that to you guys though because it, it will confuse you. And then on the other side of this to come towards the left is another yellow. And again, simple as easy. Just fill it in with black. Now from this one you'll be a little bit hesitant. You just want to come all the way along. Like so. Underneath just come with two white. One, two. Oh, apologies. Just wipe that out with the black. White one. And a black next to the white one black underneath just obviously conceal it this line here you know, I've got an extra five down so six and tell one so two three four five six black as so and then from here as you can see it's coming extra same along all the way down on this side so that beats this that's a two too thick wall a five middle one so the penultimate one so the one from the bottom here we want to come an extra two out, so one, two, and then uh, a three, sorry, and then one under each of that, underneath that, two whites just to fill that gap in, and two, and again, conceal it with the black. Now, another little trick we can do, this is a tack, so one on from the bottom, tack there, two on top of that, remove that tack now, one underneath. it was there this would be two blocks from there there we go two blocks voila that's his other hand like so as you can see his fingers are there if you can just grab your, grab a claw finger just claw your hands around look at them and then look at the image it's pretty close to toast so obviously this being his chin we're just going to line up now and connect it so pretty pretty easy let's just make an L so it just comes over the chin, as you can see. Visible stair set up one. Visible stair set up another one, but this one's going to come two to the left as well. And now we're going to do a funky floating L, which is going to be like this. We should connect onto the other side of his chin. Like so. Like so. I'll put another white block there. I like that, I like that. But that's me. That is me. Now nah, keep that black, screw it, let's keep it black. So, as you can see, we built up the half of his face. Actually, no, I've already done the half of his face, have I? Two up on the triangle, three, two, a giant L. L on its side. No, it needs to be here, I have done this. Okay, well. Looks like we've already done 
his face. Almost. Okay, cool. So we come back over to these two yellows, apologies, come back over to the two yellow G's and just this sort of bracket here, we can just fill this in just so it connects with black and exactly the same on the other side, make sure it runs all the way to the edge, obviously not connecting to this one. Come up one on this side as well, come all the way over. Miss a block here, so come one out, one along, and one down. You can actually just put a white stain clay three here, which uh, looks like his ear, which we're going to go from from there, pretty much. So, we come back in here, we can put two white tacks down, one, two, grab your black, come up one white, another white, one to the left, we're going to come up two high in, one, two, come to the left again, one along, and then from there you want to come an extra four up, so it's going to be five in total, so two, three, four, five, come back down one, come back down another one, one along to the right, and we're going to put a sort of a tack L here, so one, two, three, like so, a little L. From that one, you can actually come up four. I'm going to say, come up six from here, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Two down, one, two. You just change the time for here and the weather. There we go. Two like that, one underneath. And then we'll come an extra four out, one, two, three, four. One underneath, one, two, not like so. One underneath, one, two, like that. White tack here. From that white tack, you want to make an L, like so. And then just put an invisible stair set on that one there. And we've come together. We can actually remove all these white, these white tacks now, like so. Just build this up. There we go. It could be filled in with black in a minute. Come back over to this hair here. So obviously the three set of the L. It's literally just a stair set all the way down. So from the L, it is an extra three stair set. One, two, three, like so. And from the third one, just want to cut. So in total, there should be two, four, six. Two, four, six. Yeah, which there is. From there, come an extra one down. Another one. Another one to the right. An extra three down as well. One, two, three. Um, let's say one out to the right and come an extra four down one two three four it should connect beautifully awesome and it has brilliant we're almost there guys almost done this is almost Vegeta done as you can see his fingers are done if you sort of claw them up remember have a little look at your reference of your own hands obviously his uh, body pieces there his chest plates and everything it's almost done so we come all the way back in and we can start doing his face or his hair, his outline sort of thing. So on this block here, it's pretty easy. Just come a white stain clay, one, two black, one, two. And from this one white here, you want to come an extra one up, two up, sorry, one, two. Out of the black, up on top of that, white stain clay, come two, one, two. The black underneath that. Two more white stain clay. One, two. After that is a black. White underneath. Black. White underneath. And then this is where it gets a little, a little bit tricky. What we can do here is actually just go to the white stain clay to connect this big bit here. Actually, just connect this up like so. Now. For the rest of this, you actually just fill this little segment here with uh, white stained clay, which we're going to do. But remember, we have to do his eye. So let's do that really quickly. So just again, just carry on filling. So just fill the top of his mouth. Just fill the rest of that up. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. Fill the rest of his mouth. From the mouth, from the third block on the right, so this block here, I'm going to come up just a little bit. So black, make a black L. Switch to that white, make a four block like so, and obviously on the side of that just conceal it with black, so two up there and two along there. And the rest of that you can actually just fill it in with um, white stain clay. Pretty cool, pretty easy, so let's just fill that in. Obviously I have a little step back so you guys can see where the progress is and we can see his feet and everything because obviously we just discussed it, it's going to look a little bit weird if we left with that, and as you can see there. Pretty cool, pretty easy, so you come all the way back in. We can remove those tacks now, so come back in with those tacks, just remove them. And the rest of this big sort of mosh pit here, you can actually just fill in with black, 
which is going to be his hair. So remember guys, this has been uh, just the normal sort of version of Vegeta. Obviously you want the Super Saiyan where he's uh, sort of got, he used to have purple clothing. I've seen him with different clothing as well, which is a little bit weird. So I've done a little bit of research, but not a lot. But uh, you know, I'm not, I'm not a fanboy, but uh, I do enjoy it. I can watch it. So obviously this is for the fan people that want to do it. But remember guys, this is quite an advanced build. Um, a lot of my other ones are pretty darn easy, but this is probably, I was going to say, probably the most sort of lengthiest or the hardest one that you could probably do. So, if we just fill this in quickly and have a step back and we can have a little look. Careful what you're feeling as well, guys. You don't want to feel sort of the detailing at the top of his hair as well. Does that just look a little bit silly? Fill this in nice and quick. So, obviously, this bit here is the detailing, so don't fill that bit in. Move all that. Da, da, da. Oh, almost done. Just fill the top of this black hair in, and there we go. There is the normal version of Vegeta. I don't know why I took a screenshot, but there we go. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy. If you got stuck in any part of this video, make sure to go back and have a look. It's the beauty of a YouTube video. But uh, obviously, much more to come advanced builds and easier builds but if you enjoyed make sure you give me a like and a comment but as always guys killer kev here and killer kev out